it's a lot harder to drive when your whole body feels like it got hit by a bus. I have no idea how to even start this. Whew, a little bit rusty, a little bit rusty. Here we go, here we go. All right, if you're watching this, hello, welcome to the channel. My name's Kyle, I make videos about my car and my life and stuff. And let me be the first to congratulate you on surviving 2020. Welcome to 2021. This is, I guess, like the intro video to my 2021 channel. Does that make sense? I'm, I'm like revamping, re reviving. I've slowed down a lot. I became an adult and there've been a lot of adult things. I kind of, lost touch of what I wanted to do with YouTube and why I started making videos in the first place. So this video isn't just to tell you guys like what to expect from this channel in 2021. It's also a way to hold myself accountable for when I watch it in the future and be like, wow, you said you were going to do this and then I can compare if I, if I am doing it or not. So welcome to the channel. If you're new here, a little bit of an introduction to myself. My name is Kyle. I live in New York City, 23 years old. I started making videos at a very young age and then I got into the car scene and I started combining videos with the car scene. I started covering car meets, making cinematics of car meets out in New York City and I met some of the best friends that I could ever meet. Every time I go out with a car I meet great people and I used to record that all the time. I started watching some of my old videos and I was like man I really miss that. I miss the energy. I miss just going out filming just for fun. I think I'm gonna try really hard to get back into that this year. So Without further ado, let's go, let's go over what's going on in this channel. This channel has gone through several iterations in its lifetime. I used to daily vlog like Casey Neistat style where I made my first 500 subscribers. And then I got a car and then I couldn't daily vlog because of school. And so I started vlogging about cars and then that picked me up to like, a, like 2000. I've kind of rode that wave until now. Most of my content is car based because that's that's what I like. I, I love cars. I love going to car events. I love building cars. But I think the root of it all, even from the daily vlogging days, was like I wanted to experience as much of life as possible. It sounds really corny, but when you think about it, there there is no trial run in life. Like there's no practice run as far as we know anyway. So I try to open myself up to as many experiences as possible. Like right now, I am incredibly sore. Every part of my body hurts because yesterday, I tried snowboarding for the first time ever with my friends. And we took our cars up to the mountain and then I fell down the mountain. Okay, this is an update. I'm getting my ass kicked. There's a whole ordeal. There is no trial run in life. And I wanna make sure I act like it. I wanna make sure I experience as much as I can. I wanna meet as many people as I can and achieve all these goals that I have in mind. I wanna stop wasting time. I wanna surround myself with good people. I wanna build up my Subaru WRX, which you'll see some of you, most of you who watch this channel know what that's about. I wanna build and revamp this motorcycle that I bought. Sorry, mom and dad. And lastly, I wanna establish some sort of media company. I wanna see what it's like and I wanna, I guess, show you guys what it's like to build something from scratch that involves content creation, media creation, media partnerships, and all that. I want to build something that's bigger than myself. So, with that being said, I want to introduce or reintroduce my 2018 WRX. So we are now in my 2018 WRX. Her name is Asa. You can figure out why I named her that. Or you can just leave it a mystery. She's one of the more unique WRXs that I've seen, and that's always been the goal. Subaru is a great platform for customization. You can do a lot to really make your build unique. There are things that are almost like expected if you have a Subaru. You get a big wing, you lower it, nice wheels, and I, I've done that. I'm going to keep it short though because I will be doing a um, three years of ownership video too on this car. My goal for this car is to make it unique. I don't really care about going fast because if I want to go fast, I go on the motorcycle. But I do want to get some speed eventually. It's just it costs a lot of money to make a Subaru fast, let me tell you. My goal for 2021, I would say, is maybe make a little bit more power, but definitely set the bar even higher for what you can do with a Subaru. It's a lot harder to drive when your whole body feels like it got hit by a bus. Oh my God. Here's something you learn from snowboarding. You will fall a lot of times in life, and a lot of people will get somewhere faster than you, but the important thing is you get back up and you get down the mountain. That's like, I'm gonna write that down. But long story short about this car is that it's a representation of my ideas, of my personality. So that has been your introduction or reintroduction to Asa. 
my WRX. And now, let me introduce you to the other member, the other character, the other thing that you'll see on this channel. But first, I gotta gear up, so let me do one of these. Okay, now that I'm properly geared up, I can introduce you to my other project. You can see Asa, and that right there, ladies and gentlemen, that is Karma. Karma the Kawasaki. 2007 Kawasaki ZX6R 600cc sport bike. She got a little bit beat up. First bike I have, I have dropped her. I have low sided once. Um, you know, it's all, it's all learning experience. But she's gonna get renovated. She's gonna get done up all nice. A lot of learning experiences with this bike, and I'm, I'm gonna do her justice. She is, she's used. I bought her with 13,000 miles. I'm gonna make sure that she's taken care of and that she really glows up. video shed some light on what I'm trying to accomplish this year in terms of content and my goals. Full disclosure, I did try to vlog on the motorcycle. Had my iPhone set up and I tried to connect the headphones with the mic and you couldn't hear me at all because the motorcycle is very loud. So I guess something to add onto the list for this year is to have a nice proper moto vlogging setup. The last thing on the list, which is pretty hard to show right now is me stepping deeper into the world of freelancing in terms of freelance photography and videography. I know how to take pictures, I know how to shoot video, but it's kind of developing the business side of that that I really want to learn, I guess. I'm hoping 2021 is going to be a good year. I'm going to do everything I can to make sure I do it right, to make sure I do it big, and I would love it if you guys came along for the journey. 2021, here we go. If I gotta die, I'm going like the greats. I don't plan it, but I live like it's today. Pop a quarter, off a quarter, and I'm straight. Problem. She got stabbed me, but she came here anyway. Problem. If I gotta die, I'm gonna like the grace. 